Hello friends, this video on integrals part 37 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 36. For example in this, e to the power x dx minus 1 to 1. Here also if you see the formula will be same actually. We will use the same formula. b minus a that is 1 minus minus 1. That is 1 plus 1, right? Into limit n tends to infinite 1 by n into f of minus 1 plus f of minus 1 plus h blah 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 into f of minus 1 plus n minus 1 h correct and here what is the value of h h is nothing but b minus a that is 1 minus 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 1 plus 1 by n that is 2 by n h is 2 by n here so let's do one thing, let's convert everything into the h form because n form because here n tends to infinite. So we'll remove the h part. So let's put everything in that form. n form. So this becomes 2 into limit n tends to infinite 1 by n into f of minus 1 plus f of minus 1 plus h becomes 2 by n f of minus 1 plus 2 into h 2 into 2 by n blah 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 f of minus 1 plus n minus 1 h becomes 2 by n this is what it becomes correct so what is the value of f of minus 1 let me write this 2 into limit n tends to infinity 1 by n f of minus 1 is nothing but e to the power minus 1 f of this guy is nothing but e to the power minus 1 plus 2 by n. This gum e to the power minus 1 plus 2 into 2 by n. Dot 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 e to the power minus 1 plus n minus 1 into 2 by n. Correct. So if you see if I take e to the power minus 1 common here I can get the common part not an issue because e to the power minus 1 is common everywhere. So I take e to the power minus 1 common here. I'll take this guy out. 1 by n into e to the power minus 1. So this becomes 1. This becomes e to the power 2n. This becomes e to the power 2 into 2n. Dot dot dot. e to the power n minus 1 into 2. Correct. Now I know one formula. The formula right here. Because this is a very sim uh, similar formula to me. The formula which I know is 1 plus e to the power h plus e to the power 2h dot 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 e to the power n minus 1 into h is nothing but e to the power h to the power n minus 1 by e to the power h minus 1. This formula is familiar to me. Correct? By binomial theorem expansion, you get this formula. Now, if you compare these two guys, my h is nothing but 2 by n here. Correct? My h is nothing but 2 by n here. Correct? So let's do one thing. So let's write this formula. So this becomes 2 into limit n tends to infinity 1 by n e to the power minus 1. So this guy is e to the power h is nothing but 2 by n. 2 by n right the whole thing to the power n minus 1 by e to the power h is the thing but 2 by n minus 1 and this n n cancels correct so what you get here is nothing but 2 limit n tends to infinite 1 by n e to the power minus 1 this become e to the power 2 minus 1 right whole thing divides by e to the power 2 by n minus 1. Now if you see what I can do is I have to remove this guy now because this is an issue for me. So I know one limit formula that is e to the power x minus 1 by x right limit x tends to 0 is 1. So same thing instead of x I say 1 by n 
or 1 by n, correct? 1 by n, 1 by n. This becomes n tends to infinite. Same formula because if x is 0, 1 by n tends to infinite. So this I know. So if I can convert this guy into same pattern, if I have it to the power 2 by n. So let's say 2 by n here and 2 by n here, where my 2 by n tends to 0, you can say. Correct? Because if I have it to the power x minus 1 by x, where x tends to 0 is equal to 1. So if my 2 by n tends to 0, this guy is also equal to 1. So to convert something in this fashion, so if you see this guy, if I take here, you see this guy is here. If I take here, this guy will become, if you see here, this guy is nothing but by n here only by default. Because if you see here, this is nothing but this into n, right? So n is by default here. So this is the is nothing but but by one by n. How? Because okay, let me explain this properly here. So this guy is nothing but let me write here, limit n tends to infinity or two by n here actually why? Because two is already here, right? So like two by n here because two by n is something I'm looking for. So let's use two by n here. Nothing but e to the power minus one e square minus 1 by e to the power 2 by n minus 1 right into 2 by n correct no this guy is into 2 and this guy is into n correct now if I say divide by this so that means this is nothing but this guy divide by 2 you take here and then this guy is further divided by n. This is this guy you get. And this guy is nothing but 1. I know. Where? Limit n tends to infinity. This guy becomes 1. So my answer is e to the power minus 1 into e square minus 1. And that is my answer. So this was more of a question where you understand the limits of e. So if you know this formulas, e to the power x minus 1 by x, x tends to 0 is equal to 1. And this formula, if you know how to expand, you can solve this question. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.